Hello Achievers, welcome to Softech Forum. Today in this video we will be learning the concept of rack awareness in Hadoop. So without further delay, let's get started. We, As we know, HDFS stores the file across multiple dead nodes in a cluster. To get the maximum performance from the Hadoop cluster and to improve the network traffic during the read and write operation, name node chooses the data nodes on the same rack or the nearby racks. Rack awareness is the concept of choosing that closer data nodes based on the rack information. Who keeps this rack information? Name node keeps all the rack information. In this video, we'll be discussing what is rack, what is rack awareness in Hadoop, and why rack awareness is required. Let us understand what is rack. A rack is nothing but a series of hardware. The rack is collection of 40 to 50 data nodes connected is in the same network switch. If the network, if one network goes down, then the whole rack will be unavailable. Large Hadoop cluster is deployed into multiple racks. Now why multiple racks will be coming to know in later part of this video. What is rack awareness in Hadoop? In large Hadoop cluster, there are multiple racks. Each rack consists of dead nodes. Communication between dead nodes on the same rack is more efficient as compared to dead nodes residing into different racks. To reduce the network traffic during file read and write mechanism, name node chooses the nearest dead nodes. Name node maintains rack IDs of each data node to achieve this rack information. The concept of choosing nearest dead nodes based on the rack information is known as rack awareness. So in this picture, you are able to see how the data nodes residing in the same rack on different rack scattered, right? Last slide of my video will be coming to know how the rack awareness policies are being maintained. Why rack awareness is required? Rack awareness is required to reduce the network traffic during read and write mechanism, which is very important for the cluster performance. To make that our cluster as fault tolerant, even though the one rack goes down. Rack awareness is required to reduce the latency. Name note uses a rack awareness algorithm while placing the replicas in HDFS. What is rack awareness policies? As per the policy, you cannot keep more than one replica in one dead node. Now if, here you can see we have three blocks, block A, block B, block C with three replicas, right? Now, two rep we cannot keep two replica in single dead node. That is the against on the policy. If one dead node goes down in the track, then your two replica will be gone. But if you are spreading your replica in various dead nodes in the same rack, so if one dead node goes down, still you are having other replica in the same rack. Now, the second mechanism says you cannot keep more than two replica in the same rack. So in the first mechanism, we are coming not more than one replica in the same dead node. So we are making sure if one dead node goes down, we have another replica in the same rack to achieve the higher latency. Second mechanism, it says you keep at least one replica in the near, nearest rack, closest rack. Now, how the closest rack will be coming to know? Name node keeps all the information of the rack IDs. So by its own mechanism, it will be choosing that how my data will be residing in the closest rack. So this is the policies which rack awareness follows. By doing so, we are achieving fault tolerant and low latency cluster. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video.